Well, some of you say your water bill is higher than usual and the rate hike is draining your wallet. And if you've seen an increase on your water bill, you may be getting service from Metropolitan Sewer, also known as Metro Connects. Fox Carolina's Jennifer Phillips is live in Greenville County with why there's that increase. So we talked to administrators with Metro Connects. They tell us they have a new way of assessing bills. They also tell us they haven't had a fee increase in more than 10 years. So they needed this particular increase to help with the cost of a rehabilitation project for its system. When Dana Gentry got her recent water bill, she became flooded with concern. Around May, um, that we noticed that our water bill had gone up pretty significantly since last year. With a family of five, she wants to make sure money isn't going down the drain. It was about a 50% increase from last year to this year. She and others want to know what happened. We learned the rate hike is coming from Metropolitan Sewer, known as Metro Connects. This is a more equitable and fair billing uh, for the wastewater system. So we talked to Carol Elliott. She's the general manager with Metropolitan Sewer. We actually collect the wastewater from the homes and businesses and we transport it to Rewa for treatment. She says the company switched its billing system based on property taxes and fees to assessing rates based on water usage. What we're doing is we're contracting with Greenville Water to collect our rates on our behalf because if we don't do that, we have no idea what the water usage is. The biggest difference is everybody uses water differently and in different amounts. Greenville County Council Chairman Butch Curvin is getting calls about these new rate hikes and says County Council doesn't set metropolitan sewer rates. State legislation to set them up gave them authority to set their own rates. But he says it may be time for a change. It's time to relook, I think, at how all that is done. And Dana Gentry is looking for a change, too. I'm hoping that the rates will be more reasonable. So administrators with Metro Connects, they also tell us in the past, more than 20,000 customers would pay for services, even though they weren't connected to sewer lines. And that was all based on property taxes. So again, they say this is a more fair system to do it this way and to use water usage to analyze and assess what the bill would be. Victoria and Cody. Yeah, Jen, we've seen this a lot, too. I mean, Duke, uh, they did this. Mm -hmm. They had a lot of public, more I think, more public meetings. But it happens, especially when these companies haven't had increases in quite some time. Sometimes it is a little higher than maybe some homeowners are uh, ready for. Right, and we're told that they did uh, mail out flyers, and they also held a public hearing to explain these rate hikes and they also said that as you mentioned when you're talking about these new fees and if you haven't had fees in a long time sometimes customers are taken aback or surprised by the rates or they're probably more than what they expected just because they're just not used to paying that kind of fee. Back to you.